Hello everyone and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. So if you remember last time Sora just became a total jerk and uh, totally just went on rant against uh, Donald and Goofy totally dude. So yeah he's alone now and we have one mysterious world card to use which if you play the game or any of the games you know what it is. It's Disney, I mean Destiny Islands. So we're gonna go here. I'm gonna take a sip of water. It's the day after Thanksgiving. I've got a lot of salt in my body. Oh boy. Oh, that music though. So calming. I'm not going crazy, right? I know exactly where this is. The Bahamas? Because if you don't want to be there, I mean, I'll take your ticket. Yeah, this is our island. We're nominee and you... Every time you try to say her name fast. We're nominee and I used to play together. Hey! Could it be? Oh, Final Fantasy cameos. What's up, Sora? So, what you want to do today? Hey, guys. Am I glad to see you? Uh, hmm? Uh, what? We got food on our faces? Please, Waka. Only you can be dumb enough to not notice food stuck to your face. Hey, whoa! That's hidden below the belt, yeah? I don't know, Waka. I think Selfie's on the mark. I've actually had food suck in my beard before, so this hits home for me, too. Ah, oh, now you two teed us. Oh, yeah. You're Selfie, Waka, and... God dang it, you're Selfie... You're Selfie, Waka, and Titus. That's who you are. Titus, Titus, I never cared. Thanks for conveniently saying your names out loud. You hit your head? No, uh, just thinking aloud. I know, you're thinking about her again! Oh, I get it. Yeah, he's a total zombie when she's on his mind. That would explain why he's acting all funny towards us. I bet you want us to take a hike so you two can be alone, huh? No, I want you to learn how to speak in grammar so you stop capitalizing every other sentence. Um, I guess. Alright, alright. We'll disappear for a while. Go get her, cowboy! That's... We'll try to be quiet while we spy on you. <laughs> Not you two, Titus. Hey, it's sort of serious. Give the man some room. <laughs> Just kidding. Mostly. Not really. See you later, Sora! Right, so... Yeah, that was... Me butchering now Final Fantasy actor. I butchered... Final Fantasy voice acting, Disney voice acting, what next? Slashing slasher, anyway. No, I can't even say it right. So, Destiny Islands, if you'll notice from our pause menu here. Yarp? Oh, right, I'm using a new deck that I call the Yarp. Which is kind of bad, but, you know, I'm working on it as I go. Um, we don't have any friend cards. Uh, kind of an interesting thing, but, um, we have no friend cards, so we're going to have to rely on our own brute strength and manliness. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know, I say as I cough. Um, the enemies here are, you know, there's not a big variety. There's the tornado steps, crescendos, and dark balls, I believe, are the majority of enemies we will be facing. I'm an idiot for doing that. Oh, well, maybe we can use those guys. I was actually watching some videos of Rechain of Memories, or RE Chain of Memories, whatever you want to call it, the remake for this game. And first of all, I was like, holy crap, this game runs so much smoother than. The Game Boy version, for obvious reasons. Second of all, holy crap, Blizzaga got, like, buffed. Like, in this game, it's easily, it's easy to dodge, it doesn't really track enemies, you know. In that game, it fires off, like, ten separate Blizzard things. Uh, maybe I'm just ranting. I'm mad because I'm bad because I can't get a TV recording device, but whatever. We got a key, or a card, or a key to quiet. So, oh, and shadows, but I mean, if those aren't in a world, you've got something wrong with you, so... Oh. Come here, come here! No. So yeah, um, this is mostly a kind of a story... Oh, can I still do... No, that was a waste. Um, this is mostly a story-focused world. It's not too, too long, if I remember correctly. Um, but yeah, it's mostly story-focused, both this and the hallway coming after it, which is the dreaded boss fight that I've been talking about forever, and if you've missed out on what I've been talking about, then pay attention. Anyway, I'm gonna heal, and as always, use Cloud, because I am a wimp. 
I also saw some cool deck ideas that involved using more playing to be able to use slates more often, but I'm not that smart, nor do I have the patience to figure that all out. out. I do not have that kind of four planning in this game. I don't have four planning, I say, as I play Dwarf Fortress. Of course, those fortresses usually end within five hours, so... I don't know if that's good or bad. I'm not bragging, maybe. Possibly. Oh, we got a Mega Potion from a brush. That is... I wouldn't trust that Mega Potion if I just found it in a freaking bush, anyway. Enough about my distrust of finding items in bushes in RPGs, but... Oh, action RPGs, this is where I don't know. It's actually one o'clock in the morning. Or in the afternoon. <laughs> You see what I mean. I just woke up a couple hours ago. It's the day after Thanksgiving. Do not judge me, for I am, as they say, really weird. Oh, that was stupid of me. No, you don't. I freeze you in your tracks. <laughs> no, no, no. Get away. P emblem. I don't want you. No! God dang it. Dark balls are such dicks. All right. So I guess we're going to lose another card. Uh, if I had a slowdown tool, I would use it so I could lose something meaningless, like... I think I have a couple cure cards that I can replace. Urgh. Yeah, and he's gone. Alright, Wheel of Misfortune! Da -na 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 -na. Get one of the Keyblade cards, get one of the Keyblade cards. A three. I can... I'm okay with that. I'm just saying. So, if you... If I haven't explained it yet, I'm terribly sorry, but um... Premium cards, I don't want them because they cost less to put in your deck, but once you use them... Whether they're in the beginning of a slate or not, they're gone from your deck. Oh, this should be... yep, blitz. Um, so, they cost less, but they're gone forever once you use them, even if it's just a normal attack. So, it's not smart to fill your deck up with them, because you're going to be running out of cards really freaking quickly. Let's see if we can use this, like, right here. Is it going to hit one of them? Yes. You can hit both of them, and take both of them out. Beautiful. See you guys. So yeah, you know, it's just, it, I'm sure there's some use for them, I've seen people use them, I try to stay away from them, because I like big decks and I cannot lie, the other brothers can't deny that I don't know what I'm going with anymore. Uh, my brain is mostly still centered on turkey and stuffing, so, and of course I had, ooh, level 46, sweet. You know, take that as you will, in the end. Oh, come on, there we go. Out. Another knock up there. We should be clearing this room out quickly. Oh, come here, come here, come here. Yeah! Smack the crap out. I've always wondered if it's demoralizing to be a heartless, not only because you generally look really weird, but you know that you're getting the crap beat out of you by a kid with an with by a kid with spiky hair and oversized key in this game. Oh, uh, see, premium cards are nice to use though, because you usually feel guilty for using your first card in a slate and losing it. But in this case, I mean, you're going to lose it anyway, so why not? Oh, there we go. I think I've made this deck pretty okay. You know, I can use quite a few good slates, like Blitz and Arch Arcanum, that just totally whiffed. Oh, I got a... Yeah, that totally missed. Oh! You do not double slap me! Oh, and he's gone. Alright. Oh, get, 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 yeah. A lot of blue cards, so... I don't remember what the... Uh, map layout for this place looks like, so we'll look at it quick. Alright, if I remember correctly, we have to go like this, and then this, and then go up here. Ah, no. Since when do I know anything, right? So, I'm gonna go ahead and probably hit a Moogle room, as is tradition, which is for better or for worse at this point. And then I'm going to hit up other stuff, and then I'm gonna try to get to the cutscene room. So I'll see you on the other side.
And we're back already. Sorry. So, the reason I was kind of dicking around with those battles is because um, I was trying that Jafar card, which is supposed to... Uh, to which is supposed to um, make it so that your attack cards can't be broken. And I don't know if that works with slates, too. I was trying to test that out before I figured that all the slates I did could probably, you know, not be broken already. Unless it, I'm in a boss, so I'm going to figure that out later. Hey, Sora! What's the big rush? I know you. You're my... Are you my daddy? I mean... You're Riku! <laughs> Gee, thanks for remembering me. It's been, what, a couple of hours? Uh, never mind. Are you okay? Are you still under his control? Uh, about that. What are you talking about? Oh, oops. Drop the ball. I get it. You must be the Riku from my memories. Yeah? The Riku from my memories? Sounds like you're stuck on... Or it sounds like you're stuck in the land of make-believe. You all are! That's the... I mean... I guess I kind of am. Well, at least they're self-aware, right? <laughs> you're such a kid. Are you going to take care of her if you act like that? Ah, the capitalization. So you know where she is? I've been... Boo. Oh no, the plot device is raging through. What's happening? How should I know? Whatever it is, it can't be good. I'm going to go warn the others. Then I should go... I know, I know. It's your job to look after her. So get going. Okay, I'm going to jump in the ocean to do that. Whee! Seriously, like, if you look at the map in Kingdom Hearts 1, that is an ocean he's jumping into. Anyway, not my nerdiness. I'm gonna run through here, and let me see how far away. I think the, uh, yeah, I think the way this goes is like a coil, and then like this, and, ah, eh, whatever. I'll see you. I'm gonna speed up again. Because I am, oh, crap. Okay, I'll speed up again. See you later.
And we're back. Alright. Oh my god. 50. Alright. Let's get started. Oh, that should be... Oh, jeez. So, um... Yeah, just blasting through. I got Ragnar Ragnarok, which I proceeded to use probably too much, but... Sue me. There we go. So, um, yeah, we're level 49, so we're pretty close, I think, to being able to beat the end game, you know, the final boss. You know, no spoilers here. Oh, no, the island got destroyed. Oh, no, the... Oh, God, whatever. Sorry. Entering character mode. The island's breaking up. Oh, that was... Did I press something? Oh, jeez. Alright, so this is Dark Side. I expected a little more of a uh, time to be, like, introduced, but this is Dark Side, so obviously, um, supposed to, in the uh, Kingdom Hearts 1, you're supposed to hit his hand. And, um, or hit his hand in his head if you could. But he'll do this kind of stuff, so. He's got a lot of health. Crap. Okay, everything seems to be going a lot faster. I don't know if I broke the game or something. Oh, jeez. I don't know if I'm ready for this, Mommy. Now, let's see here. Let's see if use next will reload in time being. Just ignore his attacks. He's gonna summon shadows. I don't believe they give us experience, but they might drop health orbs or something like that. Ah, well. Come at me. Ah, can't touch this. So, yeah, one of the dicks of his, uh boss battle here is that we're constantly being pushed to the left. That's why I keep running. Or being pushed to the right, that's why I keep running to the left. Ow. Ow. You know, Dark Side, you don't have to be such a jerk about everything. You know that? There we go. Alright, I could have sworn there was more of a cutscene before that boss battle. Maybe there was. Did I just, like, black out or something? You guys are telling me. Okay, he's almost down to his third bar of HP, which is kind of depressing to say. Alright. There we go. Okay. He's just summoning Heartless, so if I go like this... I can't remember if these shadows... Oh, they just disappear with him, so I guess if you defeat them, they drop heart health orbs. That's how it happened in the last game, but or in Kingdom Hearts 1, but whatever. What do I know, right? You young people and your Kingdom Hearts 3 coming out eventually in Magnificent HD. And Starbound coming out next week on December 4th. God willing, because I've heard that thousands of times before. Oh, there we go. Oh, that almost killed heart, kill the shadow. Let's see. Oh crap. Ah, yep, should have jumped that. Oh well. We'll use a cloud on his fist here. That sounded weird. I'm gonna refrain from using slates as per usual for a little bit here. Not today, dark side. It was kind of cool to climb on his arms, like, impromptu in the original game. Like, it wasn't like a reaction command like the later games had, or a context-sensitive thing. You just... You could do it if you had a good enough grip. Okay, I should stop breaking him. Because he needs to punch the ground so I can... Oh, God. Uh, uh, dark side. There we go. Oh, crap! Of course. All right. Go ahead. Do your thing. Do your thing. There we go. Alright, there we go. So we'll just smack him around. Maybe it does more damage if you hit him on the head? I can't quite tell. Nope. Oh, get down here! Oh, nope. Ah, oh, crap. Yep, that hurt. Alright, well, whatever it does, we, we're doing we're doing plenty of damage right now. Reload. What's the next attack gonna be? Oh, crap. There we go. Come at me! Oh. Can we, oh, God, stop moving! Alright, so when he does those fist attacks, which, I mean, most people... When he does fisticuffs, I'll jump up. Alright, can I hit his head from here? No, I can't. Whatever. Yeah. Screw it. I'm wasting enough time as it is. Come at me! Your mother was a hamster and your father... Oh, crap. Your father... Your mother was a hamster and your father was a tax accountant! I know that's not the original quote, and yes, I know it's not the original quote. Don't judge me! Oh, ah, I gotta stop breaking him! Except during these attacks. Come on. We're waiting. Ah, crap. Ah, yeah, that was stupid of me not to jump, but well. All worth it. I'm doing more damage to him, I think. I hope. So we're gonna use Ragnarok again. Ah, crap. Well, we'll just break that. Break the weird, like, bowing down, blowing up attacks. Don't break the fist attacks. There we go. We're just going to use this. Oh, that did a not very decent amount of damage. And no, they do not drop health orbs, which is more than annoying. Oh, crap. 
I do not know what the gimmick card does. I don't think I remember getting gimmick cards in this fight. What the? There's a piece of wood here. Holy crap! Okay, I guess that's supposed to let me hit his head, but I mean, didn't do much. Because I didn't have any attack cards. That was bad timing. Oh well. We're gonna hit Oogie up for some regen. We're gonna smack him around a little more. Smack those big bulging biceps. Oh, yeah, it does way more damage when you hit him in the head. And it is possible to hit him from down here. There we go. Maybe we're just supposed to break him a bunch of times? Or I, I don't know. I've forgotten how gimmick cards. I think they just uh, appear randomly. Oh. Okay, we're gonna reload in the meantime. Oh, watch out. There we go. I feel like they might have given him a little too much health. Just because it's kind of tedious to attack him, but whatever. It was just me. I mean, bosses couldn't only have like one or two bars of health forever, right? I dive into the wind! Nope. Not so fast. Eh, we won't reload yet. No, we won't. Gow! Alright, and then that, and then he'll probably do an energy attack, at which point I'll break him, and then reload. Oh. hi -yo! Oh. So I think it's in every other, so every other ta fist attack will be either the pound the ground or this reach into the cookie jar. That's the official name, by the way, Brady Games. Brady Games, I'm, I'm hiring. I'm being hired. Whatever. Yeah. Oh, that was downright stupid of me. Not gonna lie. Alright, so we just lost a cure. Oh, God! I can dodge roll all the way to that? You're kidding. Come at me. Oh. Come on, you big thing. Oh, oh I gotta stop. It's, it's habit. Let him punch. This should be a into the ground. But I've been wrong before. Yeah, it actually does a lot of damage. So we're going to be look on the lookout for gimmick cards and ways to smack him in the head. We cannot reach him from down here, sadly. And we cannot jump on his head. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> I like how he's just sitting there taking it. Like, okay. Just do your thing. So I think now we can start using Cloud. What? No, bollocks on bullcrap. I hate that. Ugh. I don't know why they have to have him warping around like this. Because it's really freaking annoying. I don't know if that's Game Boy limitations or just bad boss design. But either way... Oh, come on. And of course he waits for freaking ever to attack. God, you, you freaking jerk. You made me waste my clouds. Look, I mean, I can't use the clouds in the background. They're pretty dark looking. Uh, evil looking. Oh, ah, okay. Yeah. There you go. If you want to prove you're so manly. Uh, just, I guess I don't like this boss battle. I don't remember not liking it this much, but whatever. Alright, so next time he punches the ground, which should be right now, we'll use our Arcanum. Oh, he does stay up. Sweet. So that did a little bit of damage. Here. Let's see what's he gonna do. Oh crap. Did I get hurt or I just totally. Okay, I guess you can hide behind him. Kind of a faulty attack, don't you think? Oh, come on. There we go, we broke that. We're gonna let him punch into the ground. And then smack his head! Smack his stupid face in. Twice! Oh, and I used to think this was a cool boss. It's a cool boss design. A good first boss to set the tone for the game, but... Right now, it's just kind of tedious. I don't know. Maybe I'm just excited and anticipating the next boss that we're going to face is going to be... That is, if you know what's coming up next, you know that everyone... Oh, it's Archer Canem again. God dang it. Oh, well, whatever. We'll use it again. It, used, it did a good amount of damage. Probably more than Ragnarok. You know what boss I'm talking about. No, you idiot! Just failure on so many accounts. Maybe you don't lose a card if he... No, you lose that card, so I guess I... Oh. Well, here, yeah, let's use... Let's put up, like, a... I don't know, a, a two. And then do... There we go, he should be punching the ground next. And then, yep. And then attack, and... That should do a little more damage. 
I don't know, he was flashing a lot. Oh! Which is usually against the rules, but... Oh! Ah, I know your game now, Dark Side. Don't worry. Oh! Okay, I can't punch him in the face when he's down here. I'm gonna reload. I'm running out of cards. Kind of. Well, considering I think I've lost ten cards from my deck from all these slates I've been doing. That I probably shouldn't have been doing, but... Oh, come on. Fidgety lock-on system, you... I... I applaud them for doing, you know, this is a hard kind of boss battle to do on a... The original boss battle had a lot to do with, like, running up his arms and hitting his face and that kind of stuff and blocking attacks. Oh, God, I'm an idiot. And it didn't have to do this, like, stupid swap around where your cloud loses him. Ugh, sorry, still bitter about that. Oh, I'll just smack him around in the face a couple times. Plus, you got a bonus experience for hitting him in the face, believe it or not. Here, what do I get? Nothing. Except extra damage, I suppose, to make this boss battle end faster. Oh. Okay, he's gonna do that. I am not gonna be able to hit his face. One more fist, I should be able to take him out. One or two, maybe. So this boss battle should be pretty close to over. Okay, this will be reaching into the ice cream bucket. Yeah, I said this will be reaching into the cookie bucket! Oh my god. You're kidding! Have I broke? Is he broken? Oh, okay, I was just attacking too much. Oh, you fuck. Lost all track now. There we go. Okay, he's reaching into the cookie jar, so we can smack him around a little bit more. Oh, could I finish him? No, come on, come on, no! Yeah! Oh. And once again, we're faced with that, oh my god, he's one millimeter away from health. Wow, that went way over my head. Oh, never mind, that one didn't. Okay, so this one should be punching into the ground. This one will be an energy attack. This one will be reaching into the ice cream bucket. Whoop. And he's gone. All right. An annoying boss battle to be sure, but it's done now. I don't I forget what his uh, enemy card does. But at the very least, we should level up. Oh, get here. I like it more in the uh remake where Oh, level 50 ding ding. I like it more in the remake where you can you automatically gather up all that experience at the end of the fight. So let's see what we got here. New slate. Nope. We're just going to keep boosting our CP at 925, not too too bad. Oh, we do have a cutscene here. I have to keep her safe. Namine, can you hear me? No, it's pretty si- Oh, oh, oh. I hope she can hear you. She's right there. Namine. Sora, you came for me. Namine, finally. I've been through so much just to see you. I could say the same. No, you can't! Liar. But I messed up. I really wanted to see you, but not like this. Not like what? Do I have food on my face? I was alone for so long. I couldn't bear it anymore. So I beckoned your heart to lead you here. And I'm so glad you found me. But your heart, I had to... Chain it? Maybe? Perhaps with a string of something along the lines of... Recollections of the past? Get what? See what I did there? No, it's okay. I promise I'd protect you. That's why I came. Thank you. Oh, Sora, forgive me. I'm not supposed to be in this picture. She's right. What? Oh, God, I hate this part. I don't think I remember this part. That's why I hate it. Nominee? That's not me. I'm not in your heart. I'm not in anyone's heart. I never have been. <laughs> Sword, this is the part of the... This is when Kingdom Hearts gets really dark and Sword just goes crazy and starts... Assumes a fetal position and just stays on this island for the rest of the games. Anyway, what what are you saying, Nominate? What's gotten into you? Oh, Jesus. Sora, why'd you eat those mushrooms? We were inseparable! But then I lost you. I came here so I'd never lose you again. About that. Was it really me you came for? Of course it was. I may have forgotten things in this castle, but not you. Look, you gave me this, didn't you? You still have it. My good luck charm. I can't tell which is talking now. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh my god, my brain hurts. No, Sora, don't believe me! What am I supposed to do? Oh, you know what? I think I know what's going on. Think, Sora. Think of the person who's, who's most special to you. See that faint glimmer way in the back of your heart? That's a piece of your memory, Sora. Call out to it. No matter how far away the light gets, your heart's voice will always reach it. So I think the nominee on the right, or looking out right now, 
is the one that was installed in this version of Destiny Islands, and the one on the left is the one that ran away from Axel. I don't know. But I already know who's most special to me. It's you, not... Oh? 3D! Well, suit... Again, I don't know if this is, like, 3D, or if it's very clever pixel art. I don't know. Yeah, so he gains his... The lo he regains his loss of the charm necklace and remembers... It's not Naminé, it's Kyrie. Aww. Oh, man, that was a quick change of scenery. Who? Uh, who was that? I can't remember her, but she seems so familiar. Who wouldn't remember bread purple hair? Oh, whatever. Wait, what about Naminé? Where'd she go? Uh, okay. We take... Oh, we got Oathkeeper! Square... Uh, just a minute. Where is it? Oh, there it is. So we're going to add, add that to our deck post-freaking haste. All right, I got so much to do. Oh, this video is running way long, so we're going to... Anyway. Save here. There we go. And I'm going to leave the video off here. I'm not going through that door. I'm not going through that door. I am not going through that door. I'm going to leave the video off here because there's going to be possibly one, possibly two completely hellish battles, if I remember from my childhood correctly, that are going to be waiting on the other side of this otherwise innocent looking door. So, I will see you in the next episode. This is your host, Black Kodalov, signing off from a tropical island I wish I could be on. See ya!